for the money. Whatever, but what's up, guys? Today is part two of how to make thousand dollars on YouTube selling me. My last video, I talked about all the steps you need to do to make money on YouTube. You know, what I'm digital ammo. Yeah. yeah. Today, I'm gonna talk about marketing. I mean, the first most important thing you need to identify who you're making music for. You gotta know like your crap. This is what I do, and like these people gonna listen to it because they like that. Number two, well, you need to utilize platforms you have to uh, get your music heard. Social media is like YouTube, Instagram, Twitter. Facebook. You gotta have a way to get your music in front of people so you can get discovered. I see some people like uh the event people celebrity. One thing I seen that like you shouldn't do, like do offer a rapper some money to get on his beat. Like that's literally trapping backwards. Point is to make money, not spend it. Yeah, you might get money from um him getting on it, maybe royalties or whatever, but uh I don't know, that's trapping backwards if you ask me. Now you need, well, number three, you need strategy. Really, all marketing is, is getting it in front of people. What do you want people to think of when they say your name? Pick, like, pick, have, like, a main marketing source. I'll say, like, Instagram. Like, like post on Instagram. Be on Instagram. But really, you should use all of them to just to make it easier. Number four, you got to network. Build you a circle, or at least like you and like three or four other people. Really, if you can get like a whole Instagram group chat of people, have them like on the same thing. Like, all y'all make music, do like collabs with some other size producers or either bigger producers, like network. People say, not necessarily like what you do is who you know so like if you network with certain people like say one of the young the artists or something or you reach out to one of his artists and you make them a beat or some shit eventually you know young thug gonna hear it you know like other people is gonna hear the music another thing is like free isn't necessarily like the worst thing like it's never really free depending on like you know if you know your business or not i'm not saying go and just give out hella free beats. I mean, you can do that. They'll probably get around. Like, knowing when free is a good thing is fairly important. Give a beat to, like, not even, like, a for real artist. Say, say you know somebody that, like, does something in the industry. Say they, they manage or they direct videos or some shit. Maybe they rap or maybe they, like, you know what I'm saying, can get in front of like certain people, you know what I'm saying? They gonna play their shit too, like they not necessarily just gonna sit on their shit. Promoters, I don't know, promoters like the rap, fucking the local drug dealers, like I don't know, you'll see like everybody, like everybody like the rap for some reason. And niggas is linked in together. You just gotta know which opportunity is good. More than likely, like you'll get the back end. And shit. Number five, really, this wasn't even on the sheet. Find someone you have like chemistry with and make a lot of music. The more music you make, the better. Nothing is perfect, so you know, they say practice makes perfect. Follow me on Instagram, you know what I'm saying? I don't know.